What's going on guys, it's Cliffy here. Today I'm doing my first ever foot draft. Now I've looked, well sorry, watched quite a few videos um, that obviously have the foot draft. So we're going to use a token because we do get one when we first start off. Um, and we're just going to go on professional because I am actually playing this one uh, in single player uh, rather than online. And now we've got a big formation. So striker, center forward, CDM. I don't like any of these formations really. Can I choose another one? I'm probably going to stick with a 4-1-2, 4-1-4-1. I like playing two up front, but um, we don't have that option. So here we go, Captain. Ooh. Pogba or Guarin? Inform Guarin, I've heard, is a freaking amazing card. And I mean, if you look at his stats, they're pretty good. But then Pogba as well, I've heard good things about him. I'm going to go for the Pogs. So we've got Pogba in there. Yes, I know how to play foot draft. I've watched a lot of games. Right, we're going to start off in goal. Okay, so our goalkeeper is... Valdez, Begovic, Unyama. Another inform. So we get two informs there. Um, but what we're really trying to work in is like... Hmm, I'm going to go for Alves because Diego Alves is a very good player. And um, yeah, foot draft does seem quite cool. What I think I may do in future is like do the foot draft and maybe do a video on it and then oh that's a hard one Danny Elvis um and then once I've done obviously the actual draft part which I'm showing you today I may do the games on stream or something like that um just just because I don't really want to go and do the four games just like that oh my god right um yeah you oh link with Pogba I didn't even know that I'm just, I'm still trying to get used to like doing the draft because I haven't done it really before. Um, yes, because you'll have a link with Alves. There we go. Beautiful. Okay, left back. So at the moment we're trying to go for, uh, I guess, hmm, it's a hard one. Italian, but he is Brazilian. Link that in. See, this is just like, foot draft is just such a different way to, to think about you know, like your selections and where I guess you can go um, with stuff. Because squad building is something that I quite like to do. Um, I'm going to go for Medell just to keep that Serie A link going. Because we've actually got, it's not too bad at the moment. If we can get like a, a right mid who plays in La Liga who is French, like Griezmann's old card would have been incredible because that would have linked up nicely with both Alves and Pogba. But uh, we can't go and do that. So here comes our other centre mid. And it is... Oh, that's Celta Vega, isn't it? Celta Vega, Florentina. Villarreal. What? Oh, Celta, oh, of course, Celta Vega play. Oh, yeah, that's right. We got that link there. So that's right. All right, left mid is... Oh, Adam Musa. I really, I really do want to try him. Sterling, who does have a left mid card, I thought he had a... Uh, cam card, but maybe that's just me. Juventus, um, no, Morales, and deep. If I put in in deep, then I guess I can swap over Vidal. So yeah, we'll put in in deep, swap over Vidal. Not that that does much to our chemistry. Um, now we'll go up front, so we've got our striker. Hmm. So this is hard. It makes you think about it. Giovinco, he is like he is ripping it up in the MLS at the moment, but he's not really going to work too well for the squad. In fact, none of these players are. I'm just going to go bombing. And uh, right mid is our final card for the starting eleven. Uh, one Mata, Tosic, Charisma, just nothing. Spanish, Brazilian, Willian to link up with Danny Alves. Okay, so there we go. So not a bad squad. 82 rated. But only 68 chemistry to start off with, which isn't ideal. Now we've got our subs, so hopefully we can go and pick up some of them. Really need another striker, I guess. Um, oh, no. Oh, hang on. On the bench. Uh, Serie A. Argentinian. Yep. Valdez. Sorry. Reina, you're going to have to do. What am I saying? Valdez. Victor Valdez. He was one of my first choices. Okay. Second player in the subs is... Wow. Um... French player, we've got a Brazilian, Portuguese, wow, there really is nothing there, so we're just going to draft this guy. 
really nothing there at all. Oh, Chile maybe. Can link up there. Uh, Arena Evra. Or Micon. Brazilian still. But oh, Brazilian, but Serie A. Yes, he'll do nicely. Yes, there we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Danny Alves on the bench, which is a wee bit of a loss. And that was kind of, I guess that was Brazil's, uh, pr well, not, I wouldn't say problem. But that's what Brazil, Felipe Melo, just to keep the Serie A. Um, I think when they went to the 2010 World Cup, is that they had Danny Alves and Mike on. And both were like, this is when they were in their prime. And so it was... Uh, French connection. No, that ruins that. Damn it. Now I've got all these holding midfielders. Mal I'm going to use Mello because Mello looks like a boss. No. No, I want to use Medal because, yeah, you know, yeah. Chemistry. Yeah. Yeah. But when they went to the World Cup, um, I think Danny Alves a lot of the time actually ended up playing as a centre forward uh, just because that was really all they could do. Um, Giroud, French striker. He's also going to link up with uh, Willian because of the league. Should raise. There we go. Chemistry up three. So we've dropped one rating. Um, I don't know how we have because they're identical, but that's all right. So here we go. We need some. We need some other players. Mendy, left back, French. We've got a. Uh, I could play Gonalons, I guess. As. Oh no, Diabala. Diabala. Apparently he is amazing. His team of the season card last year apparently was incredible. Um, doesn't make a difference. It actually probably would make the chemistry a touch. We think it would make it worse because Giroud links up with, I mean, obviously you get a perfect link from Pogba to Diabala, so maybe that has something to do with it. But Giroud links up with Willian and a teep on uh, left and right mid. So, right, so we've got five more left to go, and we really probably need ooh, ooh, Fernandez. Serie A, Chilean. Fernandinho, Brazilian, Premier League. No, because we don't really have many Premier League players. Fernandez. Fernandez is going to go there well. There we go. Boom. 86 Kim. That's what I'm talking about. He also gets the per well, he gets a perfect link with both Medal and the centre back, who I don't know. So. Um, that's good. So up to 86 chem now. So this has been a pretty good draft for me so far. Uh, this here we get nothing. Fur, who doesn't, he doesn't even play in the Premier League, so that's not going to help us. Uh, maybe this guy here, another French centre-back, if I can, uh, Olympiakos. I was going to say, somehow link him up, possibly. Uh, mm, no. I could play, I mean, I would lose a little something. Maybe I should, if I got Inyama... I could have played Gonalons at centre back, which I know wouldn't be perfect, but you know, you'd still be. Ooh, this guy actually looks pretty good. De Michelis, Argent Argentina. But Premier League, though. Hmm. Just going to get Martins. Not that it has any links anywhere, but you know, good player. Right, so we've got two players left. Spanish left back. All right, so final, final card. Oh my goodness, Vodenfell has taken a massive downgrade, and here's another Brazilian. How come Schalke have so many good defenders? They have like not real high-rated defenders, but just good defenders. Okay. Um, oh, we need a manager. Serie A probably. Yep, you'll do nicely. So 88 Kim. I'm pretty happy with that. I'm not. That's pretty good. 82, 70. It's not great. Seven Brazilian players, eight players from Serie A, and six players from the Liga BBVA. So not too bad, I think, for my first foot draft. And this was a whole lot of fun. So um, probably going to go and play through, uh, you know, just on single player. Maybe not on stream this time, because as you can see in my record up in the top left-hand corner, I've yet to actually play a game 
of Ultimate Team on FIFA 16. So that's something that I'm going to go and look forward to um, probably in the next couple of days. But anyway, guys, do hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please remember to leave a like. If you are new, please do subscribe. Make sure you check out my Facebook and Twitter. Links to that can be found down below in the description. Remember, check out my Facebook because I do still have that poll going for which team you would like to see on Sunday for my career mode. At the moment, Aston Villa are slightly ahead of Wigan, but you guys could turn that. Um, basically, need to vote. Uh, as soon as you see this video, I basically need to vote because by Thursday night, it is going to be cut. It's going to be the end of the poll. Whoever's on top after that is going to be the team I am going to pick for my first career mode. So we've been through that. Um, as I said, just make sure you're having a good week. Thursday today, Friday tomorrow, Don Bradman, my career reborn. Make sure you do not miss that.